I'm sorry. It appears the person you're trying to reach is in their healing era and has cut you off. You will not be granted access to this person. Please hang up and waste somebody else's time. You have served your purpose. Goodbye. What do we got for Sagittarius? Don't forget to like and subscribe if you are digging my vibe. Let's see what we got for Sagittarius. Waiting. Mmm, three of wands. Three of wands. Somebody wants to spend the block. I got five of swords at the bottom of the deck. You guys didn't leave in a, on a good note. Okay? Okay, this person might have might be an ex-partner, baby daddy, baby mama for some of you. Um, Because I got the children down here that's got to listen to all the arguing, for example. Gaslighting blaming manipulation for some of you okay somebody wants to spend the block is the energy that i'm getting sagittarius okay somebody's waiting wait, wait no they ain't change they waiting on you or they waited on you if this is past tense they just want attention this is somebody who six of wands this person is paralyzed they just want attention like see look what i can do you know that's the energy all right um they're seeking validation this is somebody that may even play the victim okay um when are you gonna come back and make things right that attitude right when they're the ones that left you because i got the magician in reverse and it's a tower that's scorpionic energy full moon in scorpio coincidence i think not i think not this is somebody that's very manipulative okay and you don't gotta witchcraft doesn't have to mean like playing with dolls and candles and wishing death on someone witchcraft can mean um gossiping anytime you're trying to change the energy for your behalf it could be gossiping it could be talking bad about someone lying about someone so this gives me the energy someone just wants to come around for attention which highly tells me narky vibes some of you may have been dealing with a narcissist who um lacks empathy is um publicly is looked as the good guy or good girl but privately they lack in empathy um never apologize don't take a accountability okay always play the wounded person okay and they're always seeking validation always want energy from you okay so that they can manipulate you the magician in reverse emotionally manipulate reminds me of a they're all different kinds of narcissists but this one reminds me of a covert narcissist look that up if you're not familiar with that type okay this is gives me the woe is me they put themselves down so you can lift them up purposely when really and truly they have very high self-esteem okay but they love putting themselves down so you can lift them up i know it's weird it's it's different it's interesting but this is what a covert narcissist does and they use their um they use covert narcissists will use stories about themselves when they were a child and things of that nature why they can't do something right that gets them out so they don't have to be held accountable for nothing well you remember i had a bad childhood or i told you this or i told you that and they never work on themselves but they constantly need that validation that's the energy i'm getting let's see what we got this person may have been a juggler okay and see i got six of six of um wands at the bottom of the deck they may have juggled you and other partners that they wanted to get attention this is coming out in the mini me sagittarius this person wants to split spin the block to see if they still have a chance i don't care if it's just been months years weeks whenever the last time y'all talked i'm also getting some lying here this person may have even had a partner and you may not have even known that whether it been a wife a husband a boyfriend girlfriend okay but this person likes to accumulate people to use as props so that they can this is giving me narky vibes i'm not gonna front it is what it is okay it's giving me narky vibes some type of narcissist and i don't use that term lightly because i've i've done a lot and continue to do a lot of research on different types of narcissists I'm, i don't just throw that word out 
okay if this was just somebody who just cheated then they were just an asshole or a cheater okay <laughs> as the old saying goes a carrot doesn't make it soup right one carrot doesn't make it soup what it what that means is just because you may see something about a narcissist a potential narcissist doesn't make them a narcissist yes narcissists can cheat but that um uh, that doesn't mean they're a narcissist they could just be a cheater yes they can be unkind but that doesn't mean that um they're 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 a narcissist they could just be an unkind person so being able to differentiate when when someone has a character of narcissism versus they meet the check mark textbook check 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 criteria of a narcissist and this person check 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 meets that criteria okay so you gotta be able to learn and know the difference okay anyway i digress back to you guys yeah they're very charming but this person had options okay still does are you gonna let them spin the block it's up to you okay free will this is very charm nine of cups is very charming they they love love okay up until it's not perfect right so they may have love bombed you in the beginning all right with knight of cups they may have confused you this can also talk about confusing you but what i'm getting is this is what they wanted they need different people around them and they may have suffered from abandonment issues i'm not going to front whoever resonates with this because people who are who have been abandoned as a child um, typically by their parents whether it be emotional or physical and or physical abandonment they need the energy of people to feel safe so instead of doing an inner work and healing that that void they all constantly want energy from different people to fill in that void and that's one one um, bucket you can't feel they can never feel and you can't either Sagittarius okay but they come off as very charming manipulative okay we got Scorpio, Gemini, Virgo in the house that just come out as, as major arcanas. Okay. Yeah, they, they romanticized. Two of Cups. They may have said that you they were your soulmate. Okay. To mirror you. Everything you like, they liked. Okay. That's usually a red flag. When they use the term soulmate all the time. Or you may have used it and romanticized the relationship. This person wants to come back around. Okay. Yep. Yep, four of swords. They keep thinking about you, daydreaming about you. What it'll be like to come, you know. They romanticize. They romanticize this relationship. And you may have done it at one point too prior to healing. So I'm getting some healing Sagittarius. Let's clarify. Yeah. I clarify four of swords. What would it be like to mar be married to you or be in a relationship with you? You're the one that got away. You're the major energy that got away. They may have had other parts and other people, but you're the main empath, Sagittarius. This may trigger somebody. I may have to put a trigger warning. Yeah, all of this is clarifying emotional fulfillment. Okay, but they still blame you with the Ten of Swords. Oh, sorry. They still blame you, the Ten of Swords. You did this. You stabbed me in the back. You left me when you when they left you. But because you wouldn't put up with their bullshit, they make themselves out to be the victim because you want it more and you know your worth, right? And Spirit says that's justice. Spirit says that's justice. That's what they get, okay? For, for a lot of you, you have closed the door on this person. You've changed your number. You've moved. You no longer talk to this person, but this person wants to come back around. They want to come back around. They feel out of, yep. Okay. Five of Pentacles. They're feeling out of the cold. Okay. You shut them out. You change your number. You move. You stop talking to them. This could have been days, weeks, months, even years ago. Okay. They could have been a Leo strength card. Okay. They let pride get in the way. But now they want to come back in. All right. They want a new start, the fool. They could have been in Aries for some of you. All right yeah yeah <sighs> what should Sagittarius do what should Sagittarius do one card please I got nine of, nine of wands okay this was gonna stress you the hell out especially if you guys um, 
especially if you guys share custody with kids okay so this is just spirit guide suggestion you know to kind of set boundaries because this is going to stress you the hell out all right free will folks free will love you